Hey, what's going on guys? It's me, Jenny. So, today I'm going to be talking to you guys about a bunch of little kids who decided to go bald eagle hunting. Yeah, so the hunting part, right? Eagle hunting or other bird hunting, small birds. Yeah, there's some laws around that, you know, where like they say, okay, you can't go hunt like a specific bird and stuff like that. But usually people go around hunting small, like, you know, quails or other like small birds that are usually in the forest or in like deserts. And no one really cares, right? Because once you hunt those birds, you're fine. But then some kids decided to go hunt the bald eagle. So why is it significant? What's so important about a bird? And more of that to come. So guys, let's get into it. Let's go. All right. So to start off with guys, let's just start talking. Let's just start off like a quick basis of what the boys were doing. So these are like three little boys, right? And when I say little, I don't mean like little, little, like they're not like at elementary school. These were three high schoolers who are all juniors and they're all 17. And of course, coronavirus. They're quarantined, they're bored, and they live in a desert. So what are they gonna do? You know, it's gonna get hot inside. So so they decided to go out in adventure and they brought their BB guns. And BB guns, of course, you guys know what those are. They're basically the airsoft guns, also known as an air gun. So they basically just brought those guns and they went and they went hunting. And I'm pretty sure they're just kind of just trying to shoot like rattlesnakes or other little things that they find. But these kids decided to shoot at birds, specifically the bald eagle. So super significant because the bald eagle is basically considered as like the bird of the USA. It is, it is a national bird, right? It's, it's all over. If you think of the USA, you think of a bald eagle everywhere. And, you know, it really symbolizes freedom and USA. So these little kids decided to hunt bald eagles and they were actually able to injure two and they killed the bald eagle. So basically the kids were arrested and their parents were forced to come pick them up and they had to pay the parents had to pay a lot of fines and since they were minors they kind of had they didn't go through that much um and they were kind of just let off by the police and they were they gave a, they were given a stern warning and of course it, it it became a huge thing so we'll talk about why this is super significant right we'll talk about the two sides we have uh democrats and the republicans so from the democratic side of course they think that the boys should not be punished too much because they think they are minors and they did just um they killed a bird and they did it by accident so they don't know so then the democrats believe that we shouldn't really punish them whereas on the other side the republicans think that this is basically like a shot at the flag because the bald eagle does signify america and these kids shooting the bald eagle it's basically like taking a shot at one of the most like you know precious things of america so the Republicans do not agree with this, and I think that the boys should face some serious turn um, punishment. But of course, they're not going to get that because um, they are minors and they did make a mistake. So my personal opinion in this is, yes, they did shoot the bald eagle, which is a very bad thing. You should never shoot the bald eagle because it's basically like, you know, taking a shot at the flag and you, you really don't want to get into that. So I think that the kids should just like face the charges that they that they must get for the bald eagle shooting. But I don't think they should be like imprisoned or anything like that because I don't think they did it on purpose. But more on that, guys, I will um, I'll be on my Instagram a lot. So if you have any more questions, come DM me. If you find more info on it, text me and we can have conversations. Follow me at jetty.solomon and I will text you guys there. So, guys, thanks so much for watching. I will see you tomorrow.